So, it's a fun way to dress up any candle, and all you need are some scissors and some sweater socks. Then get ready to get your faux fancy. That's right, oh so lovely blogger Audrey Keither is here to get us started. Welcome back to the show. Thank Happy you. 2020 to you. You have Same several you. candles lit. Yes. I'm getting quite smells, the... Uh, a lot of smells going on. Quite the, yeah, it's quite You're the... You're in the prime zone for that. Too. Yeah, it smells fantastic <laughs> over here. Uh, but no, this is a great little fun idea. Kind of what was your inspiration behind uh, the, the candle sweater here? Yes, well, just as Belinda mentioned, I get really sad when I have to take down all my holiday decor because I really go big. I don't know if you can So have you taken it down yet? I took it down kind of quickly because I okay. put it up so early. Okay. <laughs> so it's up for a while and I just got really sad because I just need a little bit more coziness. And you can bring in the blankets and all the other things that yeah. you know you can do to warm up your home. But each year I always do these sweater socks and I have never shared them before. So I Sweater socks. Swe sweater okay. sock DIY candles. So we could, I mean, we can use these obviously for our candles, but we probably yep. use them for like jars and other yes. knick-knacky stuff we have around the house Yeah, too, it right? doesn't have to be candles. And I'm kind of, I was inspired by these, you know, yeah. obviously this is a good way to do it affordably, but you know, these get expensive after a while, oh, you know, I and bet. it's also, you know, the harder. Nice glass it's nice to get the like soft, that, yeah. yeah, but I have a couple pieces in my house that I really like, and so that inspired me. So. All right, well, yeah. uh, what, so obviously the supplies that we need are like a candle and a sock. Yes, and your candle could even be gone. <laughs> I have a couple, this blue one right here, it's mm -hmm. completely dead. I just put another votive inside, so I'm upcycling all the glassware from all my other candles, so oh, okay. they can really keep around for years. So you can either um, buy sweater socks online. I have a blog post up, osolovelyblog.com, that has links to the actual ones we're using today. Oh, okay. But you can even go to a thrift store and find yeah. a sweater, a sweater arm. Oh, yeah, that's a great or idea if you for have one, one of the bigger closet, jar candles. Yeah, if you're um, kind of done with one and you want to upcycle it, just um, cut off one of the arms, which is usually good for a normal size candle. Mm -hmm. But um, you can go kid socks, which I've done on a couple. They're, it's nice to go a little tighter Yeah, so on you the have smaller a good, ones. good fit on this Yeah, so shirt. I'm going to have you do one for okay. this um, normal size candle. So this one, um, as you see, has the little bit of a turtleneck, if you will, mm -hmm. on it. So you're going to want to... So can I make a turtleneck for my candle? You totally can. Okay, let's yes. do that. So you're just, yeah, you kind of just want to measure. It doesn't have to be exact, but that's measure perfect. Measure twice, cut once. And you once. could do a little bit longer than you would think, because you're going to want to kind of tuck it okay. underneath the candle, the so glass. So right about there? Yep. So you want to use some sharp scissors, you know, make sure you get a clean line. doesn't have to be perfect because the end will be going underneath. Good, because I rarely do things perfectly. It's hard to cut straight. <laughs> All right. Especially in the morning. And then we yeah, just go so over just the top here? Yeah, wrap it over. Yep. All right. And then you'll want to tuck it in. Exactly. And then we got to give it yep. its turtleneck. Yep, turtleneck. And you want to go all the way down so it's not anywhere where the flame could get. Yeah, That's we don't a, want to create a fire hazard <laughs> A bit of a here, fire hazard. So yeah, you want to... All right. Fire safety. Look and then that, uh, right this there. one's kind of a smaller Oops. one. I'm going to do this real quick. So, you okay. know, these are kids' socks, which I like. Um, they're, they'll be a little bit tighter and kind of more snug on there. So you can choose whichever one you want. Okay. You know, you kind of do just what you did. Measure it. There, there. you go. A little cut here. And the same thing, you just kind of want to pop it right over the top. Beautiful. And you can even leave some glass exposed, kind of like, yeah. it's kind of pretty, especially if it's a... I mean, it, it really is pretty easy yeah. to do, you and know? I and give these to a lot of friends for, you know, gifts, and whenever yeah. they, a housewarming gift, or if they have us over for dinner, really easy to throw one of these together. Well, I mean, I think getting candles for somebody is something, but how about to be able to put, like, your little, you know, your little twist on yeah. it, right? And then maybe if there's something that's special between you two, you can have, like, well, this is the sweater that I wore this. Oh, and, that's you know, a good idea, yeah. Whatever. A little handmade. If thing. you don't want to cut up your sweater, though, exactly. I guess, right? So, <laughs> Uh, what else uh, can you use if I don't have some sweater socks at home or if, I don't, if I'm not going to the thrift store? What else have you guys decided to I use? I mean, I've gone through and I mean, I've taken arms off of shirts that maybe have a cool pattern. It could even just oh, yeah. be like a simple, you know, you could even do red for chiefs, you know? You want to have oh, a yeah. little bit of festivity. I don't want to cut up my weekend. jersey though. My yeah, mom's don't do jersey. The jersey. Is, it's you know, pretty really, special. It could be anything. Anything that has just that little bit of tightness to where you know it would wrap around a candle and awesome. firmly. So, yeah. It's really Very easy. cool. Audrey, thank you for being here today. I am um, so. Do you think that's? We could also probably do some like fun decorating. Oh thing yeah, you can always too, get the hot glue gun out if you want and bedazzle it. <laughs> the options are. It's not You seem like away. a bedazzle type. Of I don't. <laughs> do I? Thank you. Well, Audrey, I, you were my friend, but no, we are still bedazzling things, and we will do it later. But thank you very much for your for your time. Thank you for the great idea, Belinda. 